Hey there guys, this is Casual Kiwi and welcome back to Sky Factory 4. This is episode 14 and today we're delving into some stuff I have done a lot of and some stuff I haven't done much of at all. Uh, so I'm hoping to delve into some AE2, which I've done many, many, many times. Uh, and most of you guys have probably seen a fair bit of the old AE2 in your travels. Uh, but basically we need a couple of materials before we can delve too deep into that. So I wanted to get an inscriber up and running, which is not too bad. So pure Fluix crystals, I've gone ahead and got 64 of those because they were really, really easy and I didn't want it to be too, too time consuming. So down below, uh, mineral chunks. We put them into the metallurgic infuser with some redstone and then boom, we get fluix crystals so that was nice and simple um, so we'll show you that just real quick mineral so one of these guys with uh, some redstone uh, we'll grab one of these compressed plates and then we throw these into here yoink 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 and that goes ahead and makes some fluix crystals so really quite cool really fast uh, I probably could put eight more of them in but anyway not eight six more of those uh, but that gives us some fluix crystals um, the problem for making, we can make the inscriber, that's no problem at all, and we can make some of the presses, but a couple of the other presses, so if we go press, no, um, inscriber, these guys here, so like the inscriber engineering press, we either need to copy an existing one, or we need molten ferroboron, so ferroboron we don't have, ferroboron alloy is boron and steel. Uh, which we do not have, and it's lithium, I want to say, so ferroboron is, where is that guy, uh, here, so molten boron, and, oh no, molten steel, makes ferroboron, uh, it's this guy here, I think, which, no, that just requires the ferroboron, maybe you, the tough alloy, so tough alloy, when we get to smelting, not there, where is it, one of these guys, Molten Tough Alloy, ah, I've lost it, where's it gone, ingot former, that's not what I want, here we go, Lithium Dust and Ferroboron Alloy, which we can do in the Alloy Furnace, and that gives us Tough Alloy, uh, so we need some of this stuff, and then we can melt it down, and we can make these presses, uh, but to get these, we need Lithium, we need Boron, then we can make ferroboron. Uh, we have to go to another world. So I think we can probably get them either from the Twilight Forest or oh, we're inside a sheep. That's dodgy. Okay. Can we just. We can. Um, I think we can possibly get it from the Lost Cities world as well, but we have to go there when it's preferably daytime because going there at nighttime was horrid. Uh, but first of all, I actually want to do something else. So I want to get some deep mob learning going as well. And to get into deep mob learning, uh, I want to kill a wither because that is specifically the learning that I want to do. So I want to get a simulation chamber and I want to get that up and running with a wither data model in it so that we can try and get some pristine wither matter um, but to get a wither data model we need a dead wither so we're going to make some reinforced obsidian which shouldn't be too hard we should have grabbed that while we we're downstairs because uh, in this guy we should have a heap of obsidian i've currently turned that off because we had plenty uh, we may need to make a bit more now that we've taken it all i don't know what that sheep is doing up the ladder he's just being a bit of a weirdo but we're going to go ahead and throw that in there and we're going to make ourselves some iron bars. We've got eight. We're going to need quite a few more. So we'll make a stack more. Uh, effectively, we want to make some witherproof reinforced obsidian. Boom. We can make 28 with what we have. So we need a few more iron bars. We'll make another stack. And you want to get back on this guy. 54. Ooh, do we want some more? 54 going to be enough we'll make one more stack like so like so we'll not stack but one more, yeah one more stack of iron bars okay so hopefully that should be enough now where are we going to place this thing is the question so that uh any how about we build it off of our little weird ramp thing down there so we can probably take some some timber 
if we get in here and grab some logs, we'll grab a couple of stacks of logs, three. Oh, that didn't work. Why did that not work? We've got 62k. Whew, that's a lot of logs. We're burning through our sticks though because I have got a few speed upgrades in our uh, generator here. Oh, we're flying. Oh, we've actually filled up. So I've put 28 upgrades in there now. So we need to fill this guy for a quest anyway. But effectively that is just staying full and we should have 12.8 million RF in the storage cube which is pretty neat and then it is just powering all of our machines and doing all these things keeping everything running uh, this guy's not working we've obviously got nothing coming in at the moment all good okay let's head up here and off the center of this dude which should by rights be about here we are going to build ourselves a little extension. So we're gonna go there, yoink, and yoink. Not quite, missed, oops, there. Um, where's our ax? We don't need a hoe, our ax will be good. Like so, one, two, three, that should be fine. We're gonna go out a few blocks and then we're gonna put a little weatherproof cage. So we'll just go out to here um we'll go ahead and we will make some planks i will change this to some nicer timber oh, should we do it now let's see if we have got a chisel we do i've got a chisel cool um and what have we got in the way of we've got oops i deleted that we've got some of those yoink so we might as well copy what we're doing We'll get rid of our chickens. One, two. We're just coming out four for now. Um, yeah, I can always move it later on if I feel the need. So that'll do for now. We'll go ahead and we will do this with them. Yep, that there into those, which gives us plenty. Oh, where did that go? It's there. Yoink. and some logs and then we're going to build our little wither cage here so I'm thinking that if we build this out of that like so and if we go five wide five Yes, five by say one, two, three, four, five. We should be good. That is a terrible noise. Right guys, that's horrible and loud. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna build a little cube here and I will be back once I've got it built. Right guys, I'm back. I've got our little shack built. So I've utilized as little of this uh, reinforced obsidian as possible. There's probably a couple of blocks there that I could have not used, i.e. these guys at the front here, this, these two corners. Uh, but I think that's relatively conservative. I've got a um, little roof there so that hopefully that'll keep him in and what I can do is I can just throw a block down here as well to protect myself a bit and I will have to chip that guy out to uh, get in and collect my drops most likely unless my magnet will reach uh, but I think we can go ahead and we can spawn ourselves a wither and at worst it should only blow up this bit of timber here um, if it if at all so hopefully not but if it does it does I'm not too concerned about that so cool I think we are good to go why are we doing that? Okay, uh, so we want to grab, we have got some wither skulls that we found in the nether um, a while ago. So we've got three of them. We should have some soul sand, like so. So I think we want five of that. I can't remember, but anyway, we will go ahead and we'll go one, two, three, four, only four. And then right one, two, and then can we get out? We can. Can we do that from... No, we can't. Right. Yoink, 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 yoink. Are we ready? 
like so. We're gonna put that there, and then we're gonna have our sword ready. We're gonna back away. Mr. Button, are you ready? Where is he? Oh, he's escaped. Cool. That's not cool. And he's okay, this is awesome. This is absolutely to die. You are going to die. What the crap happened there? Please don't blow up our stuff. Please. Where is our our death? Where is our death, Mr. Miller? Our stuff is not chunk loaded, there it goes. Okay, so we've got everything back on, but how are we gonna kill this guy is my question here. That almost killed us straight away. Oh, oh, oh. Get away from our building. Get away from our building. Dizzy, it's making me dizzy. It's healing. Oh, stop turning. And we're dead. Okay, I'm gonna have to deal with this thing. I will be back. Okay, guys, I'm cheating here. I'm hoping he's falling into the void. I'm hoping that my magnet's strong enough that uh, we can maybe get these items as he. No, we're gonna die in the void too. Have we fallen through? Are we flying? Where is he? Where is he? He disappeared. I think he despawned. Okay. No, he didn't despawn. I'm still going down. No, we're not going to get his stuff. Okay, that was random. So he's died in the void. But was my enclosure too small? I'm sure I've done one that size before and haven't had an issue. Um, he has, like, completely freaking messed up my base blown some holes and everything um i kind of thought that that would have been fine obviously not um so let's go ahead and we will make this a smidge bigger and see what happens because that's kind of annoying I honestly would have thought that, that should not have been an issue. Was it because I put him against the back wall? Let's try this one more time. I've already uh, done a whole heap of damage to my base. If I've got a repair, I've got a repair. Um, so let's grab four more soul sand. And I think we've got three more with the skulls. We've got five, so almost enough to do this twice. And let's try this one more time. Oops, we've got heaps of soul sand. So we'll get rid of those chickens. And so we'll put it here this time. Right, I'm sure that this should be fine. One, two, three so this shouldn't be an issue so he just he's just gonna go through again isn't he if he does i think i'm just gonna fly he's just blowing up all my shit come on you bastard come on
Goodness, we got there in the end. Okay, so we killed one, even though that was an absolute abomination. Um, right, let's head down. So we can see our base around there. Okay, so that did a fair bit of damage. He messed with us pretty badly there. Um, what have we blown up? We've blown up some blocks down there. Bit of our storage system. Um, he missed our main power supply and everything, which is great. Okay, so that's not freaking ideal, as you can tell. Um, okay, I'm going to have to fix some stuff between episodes, but... Oh, well, we've got squids. Cool. Uh, we're going to need some dirt. Have we got some dirt? We've got one piece. Uh, can we throw that? There we can. Cool, that should fix that up. Uh, that's not going to fix that, though, is it? Uh, not going to fix that at all. Um, what have we got in the way of dirt? Crikey. Okay, we got ourselves a nether star at least. We, we did do that. It's messy, but it's done. So that's fixed the leaking water. I'm sure there's cables and things missing underneath, which... Oh, there's not. It didn't destroy any of that. Wow, okay, so that should all just work. Cool, so it looks like, realistically, it is just a cable from the other end here. And some of this stuff, which probably isn't too bad, really. Oh, we have frozen. Dumpty do, come on. Come on. Are you going to crash? Holy moly, that is really frozen. Come on, it's normally cleared by now. There we go. Okay, so, look at that. Almost all fixed up, like so. And then a few logs. Easy peasy. We haven't got terribly many animals left now, but uh, them's the breaks, I guess. And yoink, yoink. And then a bit more dirt. Maybe I should have grabbed a bit more. Oh, that's soul sand. grab might as well finish this off real quick we'll just grab a little bit more dirt and get this tidied up I can't believe it escaped twice I honestly thought that second time that it would have stayed in there but uh, when I did see it and he was just floating around free in space once he sort of formed I, it kind of made me think that he was probably going to escape for a second time but oh well it is what it is so I think, that looking at that, we're just missing these guys here, um, which should just be like, why will that not join on there? Tickety boo, and then everything should be connected, I think. Oh, we've got some roof bits. Um, that's about it. Okay, I think we got away relatively unscathed there. Relatively. What are we missing? Oh, we've got a, a few bits of roof. A few bits of roof. That, that's not too bad, I reckon. So, can we... Yoink. Where are the roofy bits? Oh, down there. That's okay, we can do that. Yoink, yoink, and yoink. And then... Are these just on there? And then we've got one left. Oh, no, so we might be missing a few more. Okay, that's okay. A few must have got blown up. <laughs> but oh well, all's that well and good. I'm not 
two can no, i am we're missing a couple there that's fine i can go ahead and fix those up at a different time the fact that our storage controller all that sort of stuff didn't get blown up is pretty pretty good to me i'm pretty excited about that okay um i accidentally didn't turn my timer back on so i'm not sure how long we've gone on this episode hopefully not too long uh, i'm gonna go ahead and throw some of oops, some of the stuff away in the storage system for now we're going to get rid of that and we're not going to use that guy again anytime soon um so we're going to j delve into the deep mob learning we're going to get rid of our red sourced reinforced obsidian recipe because that worked so freaking well um and we will build ourselves a bigger enclosure for the next time we want to do that so i think what we need to do is we need to make a simulation chamber what i might do is i might actually store our nether star so that is stored. We'll get rid of our Supremium Essence as well. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this simulation chamber and I'm going to test it on, say, a zombie or something else first to make sure that it works. So effectively, if we go at deep, there's all these different types of ones. So what we'll do is we'll make a zombie one for a start. It just takes some rotten flesh and a blank data model. And then we go ahead and we shove it in the simulation chamber. Or we go ahead and we kill them while holding it inside this guy, the deep learner. I don't particularly want to kill more withers. So I think we should just be able to put it in this guy and just let it do its thing. Yes, it's going to take a while. Um, I can leave the game on, let it do its thing. And we should get some, some wither matter. And as well as some of... We have to put, uh, not that guy, we have to put some of, uh, we'll get overworldian matter, we have to put something in there, this stuff, polymer clay, I think, um, and then it produces all of these different things. Um, and then we can use pristine matters to go into the loot fabricator, and that can create all sorts of different things with us using energy. So what we want to start off with is getting some of these blank data models so that shouldn't be too hard i think we've got all of the stuff to make those almost all so it's not too bad we need a redstone repeater which we need redstone torches which we don't have so we can do that redstone torches boom 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 we'll make six uh and then we will go ahead and oh what are we still missing the repeater of course we are that's not what we want but we do want repeaters a yoink we'll make three of them this guy uh, we were missing soot-covered redstone. Now, soot-covered redstone, uh, we crush it against a block of coal. So we need a block of coal. So we should be able to do that. Uh, coal. And we need to make a block. Like so. And then we need some redstone. Like so. And then we should be able to... I'm just going to dump this here for now. And then I think we just do this. Weirdly enough, you can't hold the left button down, you have to press it individually. And that gives us soot-covered redstone. Okay, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to leave that there for now in case we need it again. So we've got soot-covered redstone. Uh, we want to go at deep again. At deep, and then we should be able to look at getting uh, these guys. Yoink. So one data model, blank data model at that. Uh, so with that, we want to put some... Uh, flesh dried flesh so if i just put flesh rotten flesh like that we put a piece there and then this guy here we should get ourselves a zombie data model look at that so it is tier faulty so i'm not sure whether we can actually just put that straight into the this guy simulation chamber or whether or not we actually have to go and kill some first i'm hoping we can just put it straight in because otherwise it means i have to kill more withers which i don't particularly want to do in that box without testing it somehow first uh, which if i'm going to do that i'll probably do it off camera and away from my base because i don't really want to ruin my base okay but anyway let's build one of these guys and run a test so yoink we can't do that what we were missing we were missing a soot covered machine casing which requires soot covered plates which is obsidian with some of that so that we should be able to do soot covered plates soot covered machine casing should be like that which is easy done and then we should be able to throw that together we're missing one more repeater aren't we oh no it's a comparator it's slightly different so do we have enough stuff we do not we need more redstone torches 
Yoink. Yoink. Ah, what are we out of there? Redstone. So let's go ahead and we'll make a couple of stacks of that. Because we've got heaps of redstone, it's just in block form. Yet again, at deep. This guy, this guy, this guy. Oh, we don't have the torches. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Uh, we'll make a few of those. Like so, like so, like so. And we have a comparator. And now we should have a simulation chamber. Um, do we have a flux point? Point, we do not. So let's make a flux point. Plug point, this guy here, yoink. Oh, we we'll short one of those. Okay, can we make some of those? We can. Point, done, done. Okay, so then we need uh, flux ducts for these guys. Let's go and make ourselves a new machine. Okay, so where are we gonna put this stuff? Let's put it, hmm. Well, we've only got one side left, so let's put it here for now. Uh, so we want uh, this guy, the simulation chamber. Please insert a data model to begin the simulation. So, yoink, insufficient data and model. Please insert a basic model or better. Okay, zero of six. So, so that's pretty horrible. That means I have to kill six withers before I get Hmm, I'm guessing that if we go, if we go upstairs, oh, no, fully upstairs, and quickly sleep the night away. Dun, dun, dun. We're also going to have a quick munch, because we're a bit peckish. Yoink. Okay, cool. Uh, then if we throw some stuff in our system that we don't want to lose, like whatever all this stuff is, uh, we'll throw a watering can away, some fences and whatnot. Um, we'll, uh, why don't we go and quickly throw that on here so that it has got some power. If we throw uh, that there, one of you on there, and then just our flex plug on there, and then we can add more cables to that. So that should be powered now. I assume it needs power. Um, hmm, it didn't, no, it said it needed 80 RF per, per simulation, so yes, it definitely needs power. But anyway, it's got power there now. Um, I think that should be us. What we'll do is we'll throw those flux ducts back away and we're gonna shoot across to this guy here, the Lost Cities world. All right, I imagine this episode's getting quite long now, so I apologize, team. Um, right, so here we are, just spawning in. Look at all those weird ores or whatever that is in the side there. I bet you yeah, that's some ferroboron and all that good stuff. Guarantee it is. How much flight have we got left? Oh, it's actually a cave. That's pretty cool. So we can delve straight into a cave. Um, I'm just going to jump down here. I'm going to try not to fly too much because we need to um, use this guy. So we need some zombies. Because we need it to get back. So actually I should have stayed at night time, shouldn't I? And then there would have been heaps of zombies around. Should we go into that cave, I wonder? There were so many baddies here the last time I came here, it was just ridiculous. I could barely stay alive. It was absolutely insane. What is that? A mellow berry bush. Okay. A horse? Cool. 
No zombies. Come on team, I just need like six zombies. Okay, let's head back out. And find those holes. Wherever they were. There's one. Nope, that one goes to nowhere. I wish I'd eaten some more chorus fruit before I came here. That would have been quite handy. And that literally just comes back out the other side. Ah, oh, gosh dang it. Weird sparkly thing in the ground. Come on, you stupid world. Give me something that I need. Either that or I have to come back at night time. Dun dun dun. There's a hole. What's in there? Oh, there's a spider. Wow, wow, a skeleton. I can't see shit, but... damage so let's just kill some of these guys and see what happens okay so I've killed some of them what does our data model say hold shift zero data collected okay so one two why is that not collected that is in my offhand isn't it Swarm. What? Data per kill one. That, it's in my offhand. Do I have to activate it? Oh, so many zombies, and yet I'm not getting the kills for them. Um, ah. Okay, that's that's really weird. Okay, guys, what I'm going to have to do, I have to go and learn a bit more about why that is not adding up and giving me anything for my kills. And uh, probably what I'll do now, I think it's late enough that I will see you once this guy's died uh, next time. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Okay, team, I'm an idiot. I forgot that we needed the deep learner. We put the simulation model into the deep learner and then we kill the dumb things. Okay, so that was a big old, big old waste of time. So let's fly on home. If we can find our thingy, which is way over there. Before we crash into the void. And we'll make one of those guys. I think we can also do it in a simulation chamber. So I'm going to check that out as well. Let's head home. Yeah, man. Okay, so we forgot. We, I, I forgot that we need this guy. I even had him saved, so I'm, I'm a dumbass. Um, I'll admit it. Yoink. So we need one more of those, like so. And then we should be able to get our deep learner. So our deep learner. Once we put. Oh, we have to take that, if we go E, and take that out of our offhand, and then we go yoink, 
uh, we have to put uh, that guy in there. And now we just need to defeat some zombies. So we need to defeat six to reach basic. Um, and then we should be away. Okay, so cool. So we've got that in there. The zombie data model in there. We can put that in our offhand. We have it. Now we just need to kill some zombies. Now, well, what I did just read is... I thought in the simulation chamber we could go in there. So if we... No, at deep... No, we do need to still go and do that, but we can do like the trial keystone as well. Uh, we're probably not going to do that right now. I need to build a spot for that. Let's quickly head back to, we'll grab some coarse fruits, which are there. And munch on some of them real quick. Sorry, this episode has been a bit messy team. Twenty-seven minutes should be plenty. We'll put those ones away. We'll head back to this place. The why is that opened up? Okay, so we're becoming night time. So if we just go to any of these worlds, we should have plenty of zombies. Oh, our sword almost needs repair as well. We need six of these zombie models. So we're just going to drop in here. Uh, where's our pick? Like so. I'm going to fly around and we're going to try and find six zombies. Okay, so there's a ton of mobs apparently here. So there's one. Five to go. Four to go. Wow. That's a creeper. Right, where are you zombies? Come on, team. Why are you hiding from me? Oh god, I hate these walls. So annoying. Blackberries? Cool. Wow. There's one. I see you. What's in this chest? All sorts of stuff. A mystery folder. I wonder what that is. Melon seeds, all that could come in handy. Uh, a name to make sure. Okay, we've got a few more zombies. Wow. None that I can see, just a, sh a ton of creepers. Another, I thought that was a chest, it's just some tables. That was weird that that just opened. What are you? You're not a zombie. Ultron. Wow. 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 Come on, team. Zombie, 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 zombie. There's one. Right. So we've got two to go. I can hear you. Was he up instead of down? I'm guessing he was up. No? My goodness, Mr. Zombie, where are you hiding? There's one. One more. One more. There's one. Got him. Okay. So, effectively, we just want to head back. Wow, 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 w
I thought maybe I could change the system a little bit. Where's our pick? Let's find where is our spawn in thingy. Oh, it's gone dark. It's gone dark. I can't see it. Hmm. This this is gonna be hard. Uh can we see where it was? That's it there, isn't it? Where am I? I'm there. So I need to go around and past the next bridge and through. So around this world there should have been a bridge here there it is and then it should be out that way Or out that way. Hmm. Oh, have I cocked this up? Am I lost? There's that. Where am I? Oh, I'm miles away. I've gone the long way around. Okay, we're coming. We haven't got another cake on us. No, okay, this is this is not good. Am I going the correct way? J. Straight down, yes I am. Come on, flight. Go a bit quicker would be great. There we go, I can see it. I can see it. How in the heck did we get so far away? I thought we just went to one of the nearest worlds. I must have gone way around the corner. Not cool. Right, heading home. Now, my lights are short. It's so loud. we able to attack this guy. And we should be able to right click on that. Take that guy out of there. And we should be able to wang that guy. Missing poly polymer medium. So we need uh, this stuff. Polymer clay, uh, which is gold, iron, lapis, and clay. So that shouldn't be too much of an issue. So polymer clay, yoink. What are we missing there? Just clay. So that's no problem. Um, clay, 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 clay. I was going to say we should have a butt ton of clay. That'll do for now. I don't know if we actually got clay getting made at the moment, but it's not a biggie to start making it again because we have trees. We'll do a few stacks of that. Really doesn't cost us much. And we'll go ahead and throw in some polymer clay. System energy levels critical. Why? Ah, oh, because we didn't uh, collect a network. There we go. 1000 RF per tick. Holy moly. That's putting a lot of RF per tick in there. Oh, okay, it's filling. Crikey, uh, yeah, I didn't realize it was filling. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, so that has produced for us one piece of overworld in matter and no pristine matters. So that's cool. It's doing its thing. What I can do is I can go ahead and I can put some uh, item conduits on there and I can remove these items as well as pump in the clay and see what happens. So I think, guys, what I'll do is I'll end that there. This is going to keep working. It's going to keep upgrading its stuff. Every iteration that it goes through, it progresses the the card and makes things better look we've got some pristine zombie matter
awesome. Uh, what I effectively need to do for this is the same thing but with withers and then we can get the wither creating pristine matter as well and then we can use that uh, to make so pristine uh, the wither matter zombie skeleton creeper spider slime witch ghast where's the wither wither matter so uses for that we can use it to make a cobalt sapling. We can use it to make nether stars, supreme essence. Um, and I thought that was what we required to make a um, the philosopher's stone, or whatever it's called, as well for Furium. Uh, we need so some of these seeds. Uh, we need to make a, what is the stone? The stone, the stone, the stone, the stone, use of that. Hmm. We want some of these prosperity shards and they are used to make an infusion crystal and to get those, we need to get a prosperity sapling. To get a prosperity sapling is a cobalt sapling surrounded by inferium seeds. To get a cobalt sapling, we need a pristine wither matter. So that is the goal. Uh, we need that, we need purple slime, we need glowstone, we need all of these things to be able to create stuff. So effectively, we should get there eventually, but this is a start. Okay guys, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks very much for watching and I will see you next time. Yet again, apologies for the messy episode. See ya.